To write the Lewis structure for SCl6, sulfur hexachloride, we'll first count up the valence electrons. Sulfur is in group 16, sometimes called 6A. We have six valence electrons. Chlorine, seven, but we have these six here. So we'll multiply that seven by six. So six plus 42, that is 48 valence electrons for the SCl6 Lewis structure. We'll put the least electronegative atom in the center, that's sulfur. So we'll put that right there. And then we'll put six chlorines around it. So we have a total of 48 valence electrons. We'll put pairs of electrons between the atoms to form the chemical bonds. And you'll see right away that we have 12 valence electrons around that sulfur. Sulfur is an exception to the octet rule. It doesn't have to have eight. It's in period three on the periodic table. And those elements, period three and below, they can have an expanded octet. So we're okay there. We've used 12 valence electrons. Let's put valence electrons around the chlorine atoms to complete the octet for chlorine. And it's a little bit awkward, but we can see sulfur has the 12 valence electrons and each one of those chlorine atoms has eight valence electrons. We've used all 48 valence electrons and that makes this the correct Lewis structure for sulfur hexachloride SCl6. This is Dr. B and thanks for watching.